Hey guys and welcome! We just got the official trailer for the upcoming mid-season event in Battlefield 2042 alongside a lot of details to the new mode, the reward system and all the cosmetics we can expect. So the event will start next Tuesday on April 11, will be called Leviathan Rising and will last for two weeks until April 25. It comes with one new game mode, which is Shutdown that I mentioned in my last video already, 11 free or unlockable cosmetic items and three new bonds for the item store. Shutdown is an 8 vs 8 infantry only mode, played on small areas of the four maps Manifest, Exposure, Stranded and Flashpoint, and here an attacking team needs to plant EMP devices inside of three different objective areas, and a defending team needs to prevent them from doing this. Once a device was planted, it stays active for a certain amount of time and during this time the attacking team needs to hold the area to score points. When the device deactivates itself and the maximum amount of points was scored from this area, the objective is removed from the map and the attackers have to move to another objective and plant a new EMP device over there. Devices spawn at random locations on the map and the attackers need to pick them up and carry them to the objective areas. When a carrier is killed, another teammate can pick up the device again or the defending team manages to keep the attackers away from it. So it's a bit like a mix of the Call of Duty modes Control and Search and Destroy. One round will take up to 15 minutes and when it's over the teams switch sides and whoever scores the most points as attacker wins the match. As rewards, you can expect different unlockable, claimable and purchasable items, which are different for each week. And to unlock cosmetics, you need to earn ribbons again while playing the aforementioned mode, just like it was in the other events so far. In the first week, you can get the Contagion weapon charm for 15 ribbons, the Kilobyte weapon skin for the AK-24 for 40 ribbons and the Code Execution Specialist set for Pike for 75 ribbons. In the second week, you need 15 ribbons for the Marked for Death weapon charm, 40 ribbons for the Domain Authority vehicle skin for the Apache helicopter and 75 ribbons for the Denial of Service Specialist set for Casper. In addition, you will also be able to claim one free item per week, which is the Leviathan Division weapon charm in the first week and the activation weapon skin for the AM40 in the second week. And you will also find three new purchasable bundles in the store during the event, which is the activation bundle for 2400 coins with a specialist set for Angel, weapon skins for the Avances and M5A3, a vehicle skin for the EBLC RAM, a headgear for Blasco and two player card backgrounds. The second one is the deactivation bundle for 1400 coins that comes with a specialist set for Irish, weapon skins for the AM40 and M44, a vehicle skin for the Euron, a player card tag and a 1 hour XP boost and the override bundle that costs 1400 battlefield coins and includes a specialist set for Dozer, weapon skins for the SFAR and SWS10, a vehicle skin for the M1A5 and a weapon charm. The first two bundles will be available during week 1 and week 2 of the event and the last one will only be available in week 2. So loads and loads of cosmetics again, some for free and some not, and a new game mode. And only from the description it sounds pretty okay so far, but the mode doesn't seem to get changed this time. Let's see how it plays. Anyways, that was it for today, just a quick overview of the upcoming midseason event and its content and if you enjoyed this video, don't forget to drop a like or a comment below and subscribe to the channel for more content like this. On to then, thanks for watching and thanks to my members for the additional support. I'm the Catwoman and you are awesome.